Hello and welcome to the new Power BI tutorial video and in this video I want to show you as per the topic that why the rank X is not returning the output. So what do I have is basically this orders table and I will show you from where you can get it so that you can replicate this scenario. So we have this orders table which has the product subcategory over here and some of sales and what I'm trying to do is the using the rank function I'm trying to put the rank over here right. So this is not returning the rank and uh, because of that what I cannot do is do the further operations like finding the top 5 values, top 10 values which is the next level of iteration. Okay, so to correct this behavior we basically need to apply the uh, uh, one more function over here. So which is nothing but over here in the calculate in the rank function what we have is the all order subcategory, right? to produce the rank at the subcategory level and we need to wrap the calculate function on the sales right and what you are going to get is is basically the current rank over here right so what sales were earlier were doing is they were it was basically as you would expect it is taking each individual row as a separate one and producing the rank rather than taking it as a combined table and iterate over each one and then basically compare okay what is rank one and that is what calculate does it applies that row context onto this so that each value is in the context of each row and iterates over each row and then figure it out right what is the rank so that is why the uh, rank x function is not returning so from where you can get this data let me just show you very quickly over here so over here you can get this data using the link which is which i am giving the data set folder and data set is the sheet in this data set sheet the row number 19 is having this data set where you can replicate it also one more quick information about my power bi videos where all my power bi videos which is on the youtube is present as a video title over here and you can jump onto the video using the video link and get the desired output that way you can bookmark and search any of my video whenever you need it with that thank you so much i'll meet you in the new video with a new topic